When you start to draw in the Simpson styles, one of the things you'll want to consider is um, that they usually have a flat or rectangular shaped head. Um, so you can see I'm kind of showing the back and the front of the head is rectangular. They also have a very unique lip style. Um, so I kind of used Bart Simpson's lips um, profile to inspire the lips of my drawing here. A lot of times they have white circle eyes with the dot for the pupil right in the middle. And then to make um, it seem more of a feminine person, I added the eyelashes. And then remember... Um, Again, larger top lip, more of an indented lower lip, generalized teeth, so you don't see each individualized tooth, um, so more of just the overall shape. Uh, make sure to have like round, generalized arms and hands, um, so more like oval kind of shaped um, fingers. And then as I'm drawing, I'm trying to think about how can I incorporate things about myself? Well, I tend to pull my hair back in the front. Um, and so I included that. I have long hair, so I included that. Um, for the shirt, I kept it pretty simple um, in shape. I also tend to wear a necklace that has an infinity symbol um, with my children's birthstone. So I included that in there. I made the arms more rounded, and then you don't see it in the video, but I did add a paint palette and a paintbrush to show my love of art. And don't forget when you go to color to use the Simpson style. So I used the yellow for the skin tone, and then I also brought in some of my own details like the brown for my hair, the blue for my shirt because that's my favorite color. Um, so consider those things as well as you start to color it. 